welcome back to my channel. I just got off of work and I am exhausted. I've actually been a little bit sick this week, which is why I haven't been posting. And I need to recover and just refresh and have like a relaxing night. So we're gonna do a night routine. I'm a major grandma when it comes to my evenings. I like to be at home and in bed by like 10, 30, 11. It's gonna be mostly a lot of cozy things, relaxing things, nothing crazy. It's very chill. One thing that I wanna do tonight is bake something and I have these muffins in my head and I know they're like this little pack from Walmart and they're so good. So I'm gonna have to go out and grab some, but I'm just dying to make them. So we're gonna grab those first before we start anything so that by the time I'm done with that, I can just be in for the night. Okay, a little detour. I did already shower and I had my dinner, which was taquitos in the air fryer. So nothing special going on here tonight, but I did go grab the muffin mix and I am still gonna make them tonight as a little treat. And then it'll also be my breakfast in the morning probably. I am currently watching Pitch Perfect and I'll probably be doing this for the next little bit, which it's only seven o'clock, but I'll probably finish this movie and then do some journaling and stuff like that. I definitely skipped some steps or I just didn't show them. So my apologies. one pack of the muffins and it only makes six but my muffin pan has 12 spots and I recently learned if you have empty slots in your muffin pan when you go to bake it you should fill it with water so that the heat distributes evenly they don't get burnt on the other side so I'm trying it out tonight and I think it'll work really well and I'm really excited because I can smell them already and they smell so good <laughs> See, I made these and wiped it up so poorly. They literally smell so, so good. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to eat these. I could eat all of them right now. I really could. Okay, taste test, here we go. Delicious. They're so good. This is so cozy. I have my candle lit. I'm watching Pitch Perfect. This candle smells so good. I can't think of what the scent is, but it's one of those volcano candles from Anthropology, And it smells like Christmas to me, which I absolutely love. It's kind of like a berry scent and it just smells so, so good. And it's like gorgeous too. Look at it, it's like lit up like a firefly. Thank you. 
kitchen and everything is ready to go for the morning. I am going to do this little face mask that I've had for a while. It is a aloe vera cream mask and it's supposed to be nourishing and hydrating. So I don't know. It seems fun. So we're going to do it. I have to put it on and leave it for 15 minutes and then wash it off. Also, if you didn't know before, I worked at Disney for like five months and I actually, I don't know if you saw that, but I caught myself doing the two finger point and I actually do it all the time now and I can't not do it. Like it's ingrained in my head to do the two finger point. I've been gone for months and I still do it. I just, I don't think I'll ever stop, honestly. brush or anything so I'm really trying my best to make this look decent. I already got some in my hair. Ooh, I'm looking a little scary. I think that's good, I guess. I don't know. Okay, it is 9.26. I will be back in 15 minutes. I love that you can see every stroke that I did with my fingers. I'm setting a cozy environment for my room for the night. This is where I'm going to read and do some journaling before I go to bed. Okay, I just took the face mask off and my skin feels really soft right now. We'll see later if it ends up breaking me out or not, but for now, I'm feeling pretty good. It feels really soft. Maybe I'm lying to myself, but it does, I feel like it looks a little shinier. Could just be a placebo, so. I'm gonna do the rest of my skincare, which isn't a lot. I like to keep it simple and then get in bed. never been consistent with journaling or anything like that and I'm really really wanting to get more consistent with stuff like that so the plan is to start it and hopefully go through with it and stick with it as much as I can without hounding myself about it but I'm going to do this I think it's gonna be really helpful it just has different little prompts for you so like day one each day has a certain prompt with it and you can write the date and then it has like a bunch of space for you to write I'm gonna try and fill up the pages we'll see how far I get okay i did not fill it all the way up both pages but i did go a little over one page it doesn't look like that much space but it's actually a lot to write and i tend to write really concise and short like i'm not good at writing fluff so it's hard for me to fill out that much space even though it seems so small before I started writing. Now I'm going to read for a little bit and start to get sleepy because it's 10 15 and usually this is about the time where I lay in my bed just on my phone for the rest of the night so I'm gonna try and read and that will definitely make me sleepy probably faster than being on my phone. I got this book recommendation from someone that I follow on Instagram. Basically the entire book is like a Hallmark movie in a novel. It's kind of cheesy but I actually really like it sometimes you just need a heartfelt book that literally just has cheesy romance and nothing more we'll see if it gets a little bit deeper the further i get into the book but i'm really excited it's been pretty cute so far so that is all i'm gonna do tonight um it was pretty chill and relaxing which was definitely necessary i I'm going to go to bed. I hope that you enjoyed this night routine. Comment below what you do every night in your nighttime routine that sets you up perfectly for the next morning because I might want to incorporate it into mine. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! <laughs>